All right, drivers, get behind the lines. There you go. In three, two, one, power up. And the bots are off. We have all three Red Alliance bots moving. 63-34 secures the Red Alliance switch. And all three Blue Alliance bots make it across the line. Drivers take their stations as Teleop phase begins. 26.55 has a power cube. Looks like it's going for the Blue Alliance side of the scale. 55.18 has a power cube. Looks like it's going for the Red Alliance side of the scale. And it shoots it in. Securing the scale for the Red Alliance. 5.87 playing a little bit of defense. Pushing 55.18 out of the way. While 26.55 has a power cube going to the Blue Alliance exchange. 63-34 places a power cube on the Red Alliance switch. Securing it for their team. 587 continues playing defense, pushing 55-18 out of the way as it races to get a power cube across the field. We have 63-34 trying to get a power cube. Looks like it races around to the Red Alliance exchange, but 625 is putting power cubes into the Red Alliance exchange so they can use them in the vault. On the opposite side, 2655 is putting power cubes into the Blue Alliance exchange, trying to guarantee those power ups. Looks like Red Alliance has secured the Levitate power up, guaranteeing them one free climb. Red Alliance currently has control of both switches and the scale. Fifty-five eighteen has a power cube. Looks like it's trying to shoot into the scale, and it bounces off. Sixty-three thirty-four is trying to secure a power cube on the Red Alliance side. Thirty seconds left. Red Alliance has two bots trying to secure power cubes into the exchange. Sixty-three thirty-four looks like it's trying to climb. Blue Alliance activates their levitate, incurring them one free climb. 63.34 has a hook on the rope and it starts climbing. Will it make it across the line? It looks like it does. Blue Alliance has both ramps down. Now it's a question of can the bots climb aboard? And the match ends. are in. The Red Alliance takes victory with 391 points.